Hi everyone, so here's a review on the new Rainbow Blue Metal Hook. This has just recently come out and I'm actually so pleased with it so far. It's really easy to read with, hence the bent back sort of shape here. They are available in three colour choices, blue, green or pink, but since green is my favourite colour I chose it, but you can choose the other colours, any choice you want. And so, without further ado, let's get started. I'd like to start off with the tips of the metal hook. And as you can see, also the sort of the tip on the metal hook here is slightly bent, whereas the tip on the plastic hook is rather straight. So, the reason for this is because on the plastic hook, as you can see, the rubber band really has no grip or whatsoever to hold on to the back of this plastic hook or you can it's just straight whereas on the pla on the metal hook there is a slight grip so it can hold back any rubber bands and for example if you're digging in to get the cat band this bit will hold the cat band back and keep it in its place there while you grab the other bands whereas the cat band may slip um, on off your hook with the plastic hook so that's that and now we're gonna go on to the size of the little grooves here if you want to see the metal hook is slightly bigger than the plastic hook and to test that you can get a jelly band and an opaque band and what we're going to be doing is we're going to start with the plastic hook we're going to start by getting the jelly band as it is slipper, more slippery than the opaque and slowly put it into a vertical form let's raise it up to its vertical and let's see and it falls off now let's try with the metal hook and no it does not fall off even when it's vertical so as you can see the ability to hold the rubber band is greater on the metal hook and now let's try it with the opaque band. Let's try the plastic hook and see if it passed the test. Come on, plastic. Oh no, it fell off. And so now let's try the metal hook. Now as you can see, the metal hook can even go past halfway before coming off. So as you can see, the groove is much bigger on the metal hook. And so now let's go into the mini. So the mini loom that comes with this pack is this newer mini rainbow loom but the older mini rainbow loom which they have stopped producing looks like this and would have come with an older rainbow loom so the metal hook comes with this mini loom as I just explained and it does have some differences to the old mini rainbow loom so as you can see the sort of groove here is way bigger than the older one which is really small and it can hold more rubber bands and now we're going to bands each mini loom can start hold with the older mini loom I'm going to start by placing rubber bands onto the mini loom until it can hold no more rubber bands and then we'll do it with the newer mini loom so I think if I push it down it can hold one more rubber band and so as you can see the older mini loom can hold four rubber bands at maximum. Now I'm going to be doing it with the new mini loom, except I'll speed the footage up. I'll see you when I'm done. As you can see, the older mini loom can fit four rubber bands at maximum, and the newer mini loom can fit eight rubber bands at maximum. Therefore, the mini loom, the new mini loom, can definitely fit double the amount of rubber bands. Except, as you can see. It is slightly turning in a little, which indicates that it's not so sturdy as the older mini loom. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Please like if you like this video and leave me a comment. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.